Good morning and welcome back. Um, I am here with Joshua Richards. Uh, now, what is your title? What do you do at the Sioux Community Theatre Centre? <laughs> I'm the Marketing and Program Coordinator. Oh, fantastic. Well, that's exciting. There's a lot of really great shows that come through that place. Like, really, really great. Uh, you know, I've seen, I've seen, well, I've seen quite a few shows there, actually, so <laughs> can't really identify any one in particular. But you know what? Now we have something that's pretty exciting. Tell us about the Banff Mountain Film Festival. So the Banff Mountain Film Festival is a uh, film, book, and photography festival that's broken up out of Banff uh, in uh, Canada. It's on its 30th year. Um, wow. And to adjust to the pandemic or post-pandemic age, uh, they mm -hmm. have kind of changed their program for uh, this year. Okay. In the past, they used to send somebody to the facility and it would be called a road warrior and they would kind of hype up the crowd, bring a script, introduce each film, and it would be kind of a package deal where they just kind of show up and the show would roll. Cool. Uh, this year, it's uh, we got to pick from packages Okay. Um, that had different films in it, and then we get to do our own kind of intros, play the films through our own equipment, and we have prize draws, we have sponsors. Wow. Okay, so talk to me then. So I, I did go to their website. I did look. Um, now, from what I could see, you do have the option of viewing these films with the purchase of a package. You can view the, fil the films from your home, correct? There is an online component, but it doesn't have anything to do with us. That's directly okay. from BAMP. Okay. And they have their own selection of films for the online where the theaters okay. are getting our own selection. Okay, so there will be then um, a roster of films that people will be able to see. Mm -hmm. at your facility. Now is that is that roster available somewhere already? I'm sure. I, they've probably posted but we don't usually post our films ahead of time. It's, okay. a, it's a good blend of adventure films, climbing films, biking films, environmental films, social okay. issues, that kind of stuff. So when does the show go live then? So For you guys, like when does it start? So our show is going to be April 14th, so this week. Okay. Uh, doors open at 6 p.m. We have some uh, tables. We have Ogoma U, which is our primary sponsor this year. They've okay. been really supportive of the festival. And then we have Superior Climbing Adventure Co., uh, who is Sean Perrant and his company. He's always a huge hit with the crowd. He offers climbing packages as part of the prize. Oh, wow. Shows off his climbing gear and he'll take you for explorations. Oh, fantastic. Wow. Well, this is this is very exciting. So starting then on the 14th and how long does it run? Usually runs till about 9 p.m. So the show starts about 7. Okay. We have the first half and then we'll do our intermission with a prize draw, usually about okay. half an hour and then we'll be out of there by 9 30, 10 o'clock. Okay. Well, okay, so it promises to be, you know, very, uh, well, an exciting time with, with prizes to be won, you know, taking in. Now, the, the films that are featured, have they won awards already, or are they just kind of being premiered? Depends. You get a good mix. You have a lot of uh, short films. Usually there's a couple longer films, but in essence, they're usually 15 to 20 minutes, and then okay. you have a couple 40-minute films. They usually have done some kind of festival docket. Okay. and won a couple of awards, they're, we've never had a bad film. <laughs> we, we really enjoy them. They're really exciting. <laughs> well, that's, that's, that's a good news. That's a good news for sure. Okay, well, you know what? I think everybody should, you know, pause for a moment and consider this. Um, certainly, I've never seen a bad show at, at the, uh, the Sioux Community Theatre Centre. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Joshua, is there anything else that you would add what else should somebody know about this? So, uh, just to, to kind of get people in the mood for theater again, we've taken extreme measures to make sure that our facility is clean. Good. We have a really good air exchange system with a HEPA filter that will clean the air for us. We take extreme measures to make sure everybody's safe, healthy in our facility. And um, if you would like a ticket, it is uh, $25 okay. plus applicable fees. And if you're a student or a senior, 65 or older, uh, you get a $3 discount. Wow, okay. So very, very moderately priced, um, you know, and, and excellent 
information on, on your protocols and certainly important information mm -hmm. in this time of rebuilding and coming back from, you know, the pandemic and all things pandemic. So excellent. Well, you know what? Everybody should uh, make note of this April 14th, starting at 7. Um, definitely uh, make a point of, of checking that out. Joshua, I thank you so much for being here today. Thank you for having me. All right.